Happy Thursday, everyone. It is time again for Thursday Business Bites. So today I'm going to share the another core concept of the Profit First system. As you may recall, I've decided February is going to be Profit Month. So each week for Thursday Business Bites, I'm going to introduce you to an overview of uh, some of the core concepts in the Profit First cash management system and how that can help you in your cake business. So today's the second concept that I'm going to talk about, and it's called the primacy effect. This is a um, behavioral psychology theory, and basically what it means is that we as humans have the tendency to remember or place more value and focus on the first piece of information that we encounter better than information presented later on. So um, kind of another way to think about this is I'm sure you've heard the phrase, what you focus on grows. Um, you you get what you are, what, I, what we think about, we bring about, there's all different kinds of um, ways to say it, but it's really all the same concept in that if you think about something and you really focus on it, you're going to get more of that. Now, that's good or bad. So how this relates, well, let me just give you like a, a, a metaphorical example. So let's think about a garden. You're going to plant the seeds that you want, right? And you're going to nurture those seeds. And then they'll grow. And the more they grow, the less room there will be for weeds. But let's flip it and think, if you were to only focus on the weeds and kind of ignore the seeds or the plants that you want to grow, what's going to happen? You're, it's going to be imbalanced and you're going to have more weeds than the desirable plants. So it's the same concept when we're talking about profit. So the traditional accounting formula, which isn't going to go away. I mean, that's how accountants, you know, file your tax return and all those things. But the traditional formula for profit is sales minus expenses equals your profit. So what are you focusing on? You're focusing on your sales and you're focusing on your expenses. And profit becomes an afterthought. So you're worried about, I've got to have the sales. I've got to like sell more cakes, sell more cakes. Oh, I got to cover all these expenses. And if you're all wrapped up in only thinking about those two things and your profit is just kind of an afterthought, if at all, you see how profit's not going to grow because you're not nurturing it. Profit in that example is almost like a weed and we don't want that. We want the profit to flourish and grow. That's what we want to nurture. So in the profit first system, we're going to flip that equation and instead of having sales minus expenses equals profit is our afterthought, we're going to have sales minus profit is our expenses. So in this system, you're going to focus on taking your profit first. And that way profit becomes your focus and it's never forgotten. And and the way this works is you're you're being intentional about taking your profit first. And then what happens is you set that aside. Now you've got to make it work. So now your focus becomes, okay, well, I don't want to touch my profit, so I'm going to make everything work to support the level of business that I want to achieve. So now you're, you're being intentional about your profit. So profit should be an event and a focus and not an afterthought. So it's a pretty simple concept, but again, human behavior is a pretty strong thing to try and overcome. So um, we just want to kind of think about things differently. So if what you think about you bring about, let's all think about profit and then we can grow and flourish and make everyone happy with our amazing designs and be able to support ourselves because 
at the end of the day, you need to um, you need to be able to sustain your business so that you can continue to make other people happy. So, um, you know, I think a lot of people feel like they're being selfish by wanting a profit. I, I look at it very differently. If you're profitable and you're taking care of yourself, then you're able to serve people better. You're serving your customers better. So, and that's the whole point because we want to spread joy with our amazing creations. So that is the second core concept in the Profit First system. The first concept we talked about last week was about Parkinson's Law. So if you didn't watch that, it is available on the replays. Um, it's also available on our YouTube channel. Uh, I'll put links in the comments so you can go back and watch that and find that. And then today's concept, the primacy effect. And then next Thursday, we're going to talk about the third core concept of the Profit First system and uh, how you can apply that to your baking business. And I, if you want more support and more coaching and more information about not only Profit First, but starting or growing your own baking business, I invite you to check out Cake Biz Boot Camp. We have, it's all online, on-demand, uh, subscription-based courses. We've got three levels. We've got basic training, which uh, gets you your how to start a cake business, how to price your product, and then also some marketing training. It also includes um, a pricing calculator where you can put in your costs and your ingredients and put in your desired profit margin and it'll instantly tell you how much you should charge for that cake. So um, that tool uh, alone is worth the price of um, basic training. So that one is $19.99 a month. You can cancel any time. And then we have two other levels um, that are more advanced. And our top two plans do have a seven day free trial. So if you think you wanna check that out, um, I invite you to do that and I will put the link in the comments so you can read more about Cake Biz Bootcamp. And um, now is an, a, an amazing time to jump in because the prices will be going up. And so if you sign up before they go up, you lock in your rate. So um, it's, it's really affordable a lot of amazing information that will really help you. It's all the concepts that I used to quit my day job and do cakes full time. So, um, and then one other thing I wanna mention, I'm also still taking applications for my case studies. I've mentioned um, in a few previous lives that I'm working on some new content for Cake Business School, and I'm looking for um, cake artists and bakers who are interested in participating in a case study to go through uh, all of the content in Cake Biz Bootcamp, including help and support with Profit First implementation. And if you do want to apply to be part of that case study, you will get advanced camp plus Profit First implementation at a hugely discounted rate. So I will put the link to the application in the comments also. Um, I, I will look at every application that comes in. I'm only accepting 10 people um, because it's pretty intensive and it's a lot of support. So I'll put the uh, application link in there. A link to the uh, last week's Thursday Business Bites. You can check out um, the first concept of Profit First if you missed it. And I think that's it. I think that's it for today, guys. So I'll be back on Tuesday of next week with another Technique Tuesday. And then again, obviously, Thursday for Thursday Business Bites. So I hope you guys all have an amazing rest of your day. And remember that it's time to live your sweet business dreams. And I know you can do it because I did it. So take care, guys, and I'll see you next time.